Yo guys, what's up? We're in Hong Kong's number one theme park, Ocean Park. Let's go, check it out! So this is traditional egg waffle, <laughs> super, super famous and popular in Hong Kong. It's nice and warm. It's crispy on the outside, but soft in the middle. This time we have went for the chocolate sauce and we're going to check it out. Ah, oh, chocolate. Mmm. Mm. Yummy. Yeah. Mm. Chicken mom, steam chicken mom. So it's sweet bread. Really soft, the thing. Like a chicken mush type thing. Mm. Pretty dry because it's just a steam bun and the chicken and no sauce. Okay, so this one is the steamed fried pork bun. So it's a steamed bun again with a sweet bread. But even though it's fried, it's not crispy. It's quite like soft and soggy, but let's see what it tastes like. The sweet bun's quite nice because it's got a lot of sugar, it's pretty sweet. But again, the pork is pretty dry and would really help if there was some sauce in there. Okay, so we have two pizzas of chicken, fries, a large drink, and some mango pudding, all for $98, which is about nine pounds. So quite expensive, but let's check it out. Mmm, mmm, crispy. Really crispy on the outside with a butter, really juicy on the inside. So it says mango flavor pudding, which tells me right away it's not real mango. It's really juicy, you can see the water, the juice flying out. Mm. Okay, so it's like a gelatin with real pieces of mango in it. Loads of mango juice as well, or water. Mango flavored juice. It's actually not bad, it's pretty good. Gone. Ah, uh, aku makan semuanya. So this is spicy fish ball. Hi. Mm. Mm. And it's like a hot curry, but not too hot, pretty good actually. Spicy, but quite good. Oh my god, just one. 
These are probably the best fish balls I've had in a very, very long time. Really? You can see they're massive compared to what you might find on the street. No, for me, too spicy, but quite good. Ah, for me, I need water, I need water. Let's get more food. Three years in Hong Kong, and this is the magical drink I've always heard about. Uh, it's a yin, yin yuan, that pronunciation is completely wrong, but it's Hong Kong style milk tea and coffee mixed together. So half milk tea, half coffee. Let's check it out. Coffee and milk tea. It tastes coffee and milk tea. It's a bit strange. It's um, really sweet milk tea with condensed milk. And then kind of afterwards you get like a slight coffee flavor. That's it. I don't like. It actually gets better the more you try it. cotton candy $38 which is about three pounds fifty so super expensive but let's check it out oh, it smells so sweet I can't wait I don't know how to eat maybe just bite mm. <laughs> it's like super sticky at the start but then it just melts in your mouth and disappears within like one second Unbelievable. So sweet. Mm. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, hit the subscribe button and check out some more. See you next time. Bye. Jai Jin. Don't forget to subscribe and like our video.